good of you to come. This time, it will be a trial of character. Bear in mind, death is final. Nothing will be saved. Come on, wake up. You need to get a going. Hey, 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 everybody. My name is Nyolf. Welcome to Amnesia Justine. So, this is a very, very wanted and waited uh, video, and as you can tell by the title, I am drunk. Holy shit, I feel lightheaded, and I actually have been drinking for about half an hour. Ugh. And still drinking, so if you hear me drink, uh, the reason why I don't edit it out is simply because I either edited it drunk and didn't care, or I left it in simply because... Yeah. So yeah, this is uh, I point I had I had announced that I would, <laughs> I had announced that I I asked if you guys if you wanted me to do Justine drunk and you guys did in fact do it. So let's jump into it. So as far as I know, uh, I haven't actually beaten Justine, but it is a one shot. Uh, styled game mode, you cannot die or save. In case you were curious on the startup uh, message at the start of the video. Oh god. So yeah, I'm drunk. I'm not going to care about the horror, I think. Hi hey, buddy. How's it going? No, don't walk towards me. No, you're, you're doing the opposite of what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to walk away. There you go. So yeah, um... I feel so lightheaded, it's not even funny. And that looks like a lantern up there. So I'm probably going to be extremely talkative. From what I've been told is I'm extremely giggly and extremely uh, talkative when intoxicated. Uh, currently I have two drinks on me. I'm drinking a screwdriver. For those that don't know what a screwdriver is, it is basically vodka and orange juice. And I'm also drinking a lime flavored orange juice. Or lime flavored vodka. You are now listening to the sound of my disembodied voice. It will serve you no purpose to look for me, for this is a voice from the past. Okay. I you welcome to my cabinet of perturbation. It is my study of the human psyche, specifically yours. A okay. Of recordings have been prepared to chaperone you through the chambers ahead. There are cool. parts to this study, and it is up to you not only to pass. Okay, cool. Don't really care. Alright, let's go. Holy shit, I'm really warm now. <laughs> okay. It's amazing how alcohol makes you not give the slightest of fuck. <laughs> Alright, that's a dead end. So we're gonna go this way. Hey, buddy. How's it going? Oh. Broken ladder. Cool. I also forgot to change my settings. There we go. Now, because I actually have a mouse where there is a sensitivity uh, button on the mouse. So if anybody was wondering why, how I'm able to change my sensitivity without going into the settings, that's how. Alright, let's see. Oh god, that's a lot of text. Solution, Spectre Morat of the Serete Nishale. I don't know. I'm not even gonna try. Uh, as you very well know, the chief of the police in Kalis has turned down my request to pursue Justine Florbel from stealing my son, excuse me, away. Ever since their affair started, Al Aleos Alois, my son, f has forsaken his duties to his family and failed to pursue his career. Since this law seems to unable to find the crime within the realm of 
Mademoiselle Justine's actions, I will ask you to receive Dr. Victor Fournier later this week. He is respectable. Don't know what that is. I don't know French. Uh, many of you know that I am Canadian. Uh, I do not know French very well. I actually try to avoid French as much as possible. Uh, simply one, French does not is not a language I am interested in, and second of all, I'm really bad at it. <laughs> the only thing I really know is very, like, basic stuff like, hello, how are you, I'm good, blah blah blah. Uh, since the law seems unable to find the crime within the realm of Mademoiselle he is respectable and an expert in human psyche, and he believes he may have found a legal way to ins... Incarcerate her if he is able to diagnose her as an hysteric. His it would provide you an ample excuse to have her locked up. I trust you and your agency will not turn us down. Cor Cordialment Lucien Racine. Keep in mind, I am intoxicated. I cannot read. Okay. You heard that? Oh, you're fucking here already. Okay, cool. Oh fuck, you're coming over here. Oh fuck, you're coming over here. That's not good. Don't break the door. Don't break the door. You're breaking the door! Stop! <laughs> My door! Oh fuck, he's coming in the room. Look away. I want a drink! Let me drink! Stop talking, you're creepy. Nice ass, buddy. Do you do squats? Do you like to squat? Don't turn around, don't turn around, don't turn around, don't turn around. I hope you live up to your reputation of being blind. Cool. So the rumors are true. Oh, you heard that. You heard that, didn't you? <gasps> yeah, you heard that. No, it's not me. Fuck you. Don't hump the door. Oh, you're humping the door. God damn it, you pervert. Oh, God, you have a powerful crotch. Okay, and you want... Do you want a violin? Do you, do you, wanna, do you want to play some romance or music? Music, uh huh. That moment when you get French when you're intoxicated. Okay, I'm just gonna take this line. I'm hope you don't mind. Don't turn around. That moment when all in the care in the world is gone. Okay. Uh, by the sounds of it, he's gone. Okay. Okay. Um, so Justine said that there was a way to save everybody. So I'm gonna. Tr I know that you have to kill this guy to proceed, um, but I'm going to try and save him. I'm going to try. I can't guarantee, but I'm going to try. Uh, forgive me. No. Justine, my love, I know I am not talented as Marlo. Malo, or as strong as Basile, but I am certain my love is truer. Do not my, do not my scars tell you so. I will continue to cut myself as long as it pleases you. I would even kill Basile if you wish. I know you say you like it, but he is hurting you. I will trick him into consume the bromide. Poor Justine. I will help. Just ask me to help, Elios. So, uh, for those that don't know, um, those three names I gave out were, are the different, uh, creatures that you just witnessed. One of them chasing me in this room was one of them. Uh, so we actually need a key. I sort of remember. So, yeah, we're actually, uh, a female in this playthrough. I think we're actually playing as Justine as us. I am so sorry. Why'd you write it in blood? You could have written it in, like, marker or something. You know? You didn't have to use your blood. Can you hear me? 
I'm trying to set things right, buddy. Trust me. I'm trying. I just don't know how. Okay, I'm gonna pull... I think I'm gonna pull the switch, because I don't, I don't really want to, but... Keep in mind, uh, for those that have problem with torturous acts... Oh, Jesus. Calm down, Barrel. Uh, for those that have problems with torture and stuff like that, this is not the game you should be watching. Because this game is fucked up. I also... I know of a game that is more fucked up. Cry of Fear, if any of you know it. I'm sure you do. It's extremely old. Uh, but if you don't, that game actually warns you... That you will get fucked up from the game. So do not play it unless you want. I'm, you know what? I'm just gonna shut up. Okay, um. Also, keep in mind, this is my first time ever recording Intoxicated, so. This is a fun experiment for me, and it is ridiculous humor for you. So. I'm trying, if you're wondering what I'm trying to do, I'm trying to get the box. I'm trying to get on the stupid barrel. Fucking, fuck it! Fucking barrels, man. Barrels are assholes. Stay, you stupid octagon shaped fuck. Stay. Oh my god, fucking. I don't know how I did that, but that was fucking awesome. Oh god. Okay, stay. Got it. Motherfucker. Okay. Uh, rotate. Learn physics. I can't grab anything else. Okay, fuck it. I'm gonna pull the lever. Pull. Please be reasonable. You don't have to do this. How did you escape? Trying to budge. It won't budge. Oh, I'm fucking stupid. I just remembered that I could just do this. <laughs> Whoops. Alright. Alright, let's put that there. Stay. Stay. Oh, you see those fucking skills! Oh, what? Okay, get the fuck. Yeah, just gonna knock everything off because fucking angry drunk. Raw, 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 ma, raw, ma, ma. Get the fuck out of here. <gasps> Tinder wax cylinder. It's called a Tinder box, you piece of shit. Oh, it's not. Okay. A wax cylinder for a phonograph. Ooh, ow! I didn't know that was a thing. Yo, secret! <gasps> oh, fuck, you're coming this way. Nope. You're fucking drunker than me, buddy. Alright, I gotta keep drinking so I can keep up my drunken attitude. <sighs> I am not including brand names, by the way, simply because of I am not sponsored. So, yeah. I'm probably gonna regret this in the morning, especially considering I work in the morning. <laughs> so this is gonna be fun. All right, let's see. Uh, are you still here? Okay, I think you're gone. Knowing amnesia, you're gone. Okay. 
And then that's where I came from. That's where I started. Alright. <sighs> I think I have to kill the guy. I think the game lied to me. I think I have to kill him. I don't want to. Oh, wait, no. Ooh, let's go back. Hang on. Uh, this way, right? No, that's not the way. This way. Then this way. So I can't use my fucking lantern! Okay. Play this. Cylinder. There is a cylinder in the phonograph already. Fuck, well, how do I remove it? I want to remove it. I want to remove the phonograph. My pathetic Russian accent. Because everybody knows that when you get drunk, you turn Russian. I am Justine. How about a coincidence? Okay, let's see. I uh, can't read it. And it's not because I'm intoxicated. Well, that's probably part of it, but it's not the main reason. Oh, excuse me. Can you hear me? It's not too late. Boop. Oh. I'm sorry, buddy. I, a piece of a broken ladder. What do I use the fucking ladder on? What do I use the ladder on? <gasps> oh, I think I have an idea. I think I have an idea. Give me a moment. Okay, let's try. Fucking bullshit! I, I spit in her lies. You lie, game. You lie. You lie. Fuck. Fuck. I'm pretty sure this is where we use it. I don't want to kill him. Yes. Can't you hear the banging? You stupid shit. Stay. Clearly there is somebody here. See? Even drunk I know you're stupid. Ha ha ha. Okay. Um... Haha! -ha! There we go. Hoo there we go. Okay, I'm not gonna kill him. We're going to progress without killing him. So this is probably gonna be a long episode. Shut the fuck up. You don't scare me, you piece of shit. Yeah, I guess that's a circle. Is it a circle? <gasps> Jesus. You scared the shit out of me, you piece of shit. Okay. Wait, what? Ow! My fucking legs. Oh, it, it, it was a circle. God fucking... Those are really fast low screens. This is what I expect of today. And this game isn't even new and new age. Fucking cockroach. Cockroach. <laughs> I expect that for new end games like from today. But surprisingly we don't have those fast load screens. Okay, I think that's where I need to go if I remember correctly. So I'm gonna go this way. That's a dead end. That's a lot of a dead end that I don't want to do. Alright. Damn, my leg. There is no cylinder in the phonograph. There is now!
wine. Absinthe, silly Basile. Strong men like you don't drink wine. Wine is for helpless women, like myself. My head. What is this thing? Get me out. I'm not up for your games. No. <laughs> you have to say it first. How beautiful am I? Plenty. Now let me out of this thing. No, that is not what you say. Uh, your beauty is blinding. Ah, my eyes! What have you done to my eyes? Justine, this isn't funny. You've blinded me. Ha uh ha, -huh. can't catch me now. I'll kill you, you whore! Well, even drunk, that escalated extremely fast. So, Justine's like a psycho or something? So, this is actually new to me. That or it's been like so long that I've never heard it. Or I'm not familiar with it. Alright, what's this? Library. I don't think I want to go to the library. Not yet, anyway. There was a normal door over here, right? Hello? Knock, knock. Motherfucker. Alright. Feel free to pause. Feel free to pause. Alright. Moving on. Click, click. Ooh, a knife. Put the potato. Congratulations for coming this far. I'm so excited for you. I do hope you managed to save Monsieur Fournier. He was a friend, and a colleague of my papa, you know. Okay. Fellow, a real bon garçon, but frail of mine. He puts up an impressive front, but it is all an act, I assure you. Please, go on. We are just getting started. Okay. That moment when you're so intoxicated, you don't care that you're playing a Psycho Girls game. <laughs> it's like the Hunger Games, where you just don't give a shit. Alrighty, library. Alright. Another little sip of uh, the drink. Okay, so I remember this part, so I'm actually just gonna kind of, um, fuck this pot. I'm going to, uh, kind of, like, speed run this part, if you will. Tin box, tin box. The tests have been going well. The most long term, and in you know, the sense of the most promising one, is the light box. Having Justine choose a slide, eventually a mood for every day is a great way to see the larger overall development of her mind. She definitely reads things into the slides and had not foreseen. Uh, her remarkable imagination turns to turns the characters into just about anything and she is able to effortlessly reduce all her experiences into one of the four character slides. Using the puzzle lock has proven more difficult as she tends to always choose two slides with the characters facing the same way. I always asked her why this is but she doesn't seem to fully understand why I, what I am asking. Okay. You guys are a lot less scary when I don't care. Alright, so this is the creepy room. So we're gonna come back to this room in a sec. Um, 
fuck this book in particular. And this one too. Tinderbox! My fucking book, leave my tinderboxes alone. Alright, um. Uh... Who are you? Who's there? No one. Okay. We're gonna ignore him. We're gonna let everybody live. I've killed everybody before, but we're not gonna... We're not gonna do it this time. Okay. Okay. Cool. Alright. Cool. I think we're missing some slides. I think I missed one in here. I'm pretty sure there's one in here somewhere. Fuck you. Ah, there it is. Alright, so I'm going to end this episode here. So with that being said, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to hit the like button, leave a comment, check my cards, see some more stuff I've done for you guys. And hit that subscribe button if you want to see more. With that being said, guys, I hope to catch you guys in the next video. Bye bye <laughs>